Well, hello and welcome. This is actually my first long form video on YouTube on this account. So this is kind of exciting. With the release of Jurassic World Dominion coming out tomorrow, I thought if I'm ever going to show off my Jurassic Park physical media collection, now would be the time to do it. So I hope you enjoy what I have to show off. So here we go. Here is the stack of stuff I have. It's nothing too crazy to show off. Only a few titles, but I think a couple of them look pretty dang cool. Let's start off with this guy. There was a steelbook line that Universal came out with about seven, eight years ago called Real Heroes. Here is the Jurassic Park edition. I really like the cartoon style that they went with here. I think this title looks absolutely sharp. If we pan over to the back here, you can also see that the back is not a lot to look at. It's got all the bonus features and everything. Nowadays, this information is put on a J card, but they did not do that eight years ago. So here's what we got. And if we flip it over, again, not a lot to look at here. Very plain Jane inside and the discs have no artwork whatsoever. I want to say it was a year or two ago. They came out with this Jurassic World Collection 4K Steelbook. The only reason I picked this up was because Best Buy Retail had a whoopsie. They only had this marked for 10 bucks. Of course, I was going to pick it up for 10 bucks. But if we get a little zoom in action here, there's a lot of little hidden details that I like to see in these releases. It's kind of the same mirror image, just only in blue this time. So it's a little lazy on the back, but let's flip to the goodies. And unfortunately, this is a stack pack release. I hate it when companies go and stack discs on top of each other. It does not make sense to me at all. Let me show you what I mean. I took the discs out here and you can kind of see how thick that middle section is. It holds all three of these discs. I don't know why they decided to do it this way, but let's look at the artwork on the discs because at least there's some art on these. The 4K format has actually been pretty decent when it comes to putting nice imagery on their discs. There was Jurassic Park. Here's The Lost World. Just got done rewatching Lost World. The CGI does not hold up that well. Jurassic Park has way better CGI than The Lost World does. I'm very nervous to go and rewatch Jurassic Park 3 as well. All I remember from this movie is Alan Grant saying, Alan! Or at least one of the raptors did to wake him up from the plane. Alan! And now when I go to put all the discs back, it's a, it's a big pain in the butt. I mean, gotta click on one at a time. Very obnoxious. 4K discs scratch pretty dang easy too. I don't know why they couldn't use the Blu-ray scratch resistant technology on these, but it's kind of obnoxious. And just so you have a look, here are what the Jurassic World discs look like. Here is the first Jurassic World and here is Fallen Kingdom. Not too shabby. It also came with a bonus disc right here. Five movie collection. This is a Blu-ray. It's got all the goodies because, unfortunately, none of these discs have special features in them. It's all saved for this one. And now, just because I have them, let's quickly show off the VHS tapes. First off is the one for The Lost World. I also have the one that includes the lenticular, but I have no idea where that VHS is. It's kind of upsetting me because that VHS is fantastic. This is the bare bones release of this movie. I don't know. It's okay. And here, in all of its shiny goodness, is the cover for Jurassic Park 3. Pretty simplistic. I'm kind of a fan of that. Pan over to the side. We got a dino going, if I can see it. It's almost too shiny here. It's going, rawr! Then we go to the back. It's a thrill ride. I don't know if it's a good thrill ride, but it'll, it might put you to sleep. It might be a good ride for that. And there you have it, folks. Here are all the releases I have for Jurassic Park. What's your favorite movie in the series? Let me know in the comments. Since this is my first attempt at long form content here on YouTube, normally I just throw all of my shorts that I have from TikTok, toss them onto here so more people can see them. What long form content do you want to see from me? What titles do you want to see from my vast collection over here and over here? And I got a DVD dungeon and I got VHS room. Let me know what you want to see in the comments because I am all ears.